Hey guys, this is Patrick Lee from Slush Films, and today we're bringing another tutorial on the Java programming language. So today we're going to be looking at user input, and uh, first of all, what is user input? Uh, user input is anything that the user could type into the program. So say I ask the user, what is your name? Uh, the user can type in their name. So that's basically user input. And uh, first, to get user input, we have to import the actual thing that runs the user input and this is to do this we're going to type in import and then we're going to type in java dot util dot scanner and this is the user input thing that we're going to use and to first activate the um, create we have to create first we have to create a new user input and this is not actually um, making the user input it we're just gonna initialize the the scanner so to do this we're gonna type in scanner and then we're gonna call it something let's call it input um, you could name it anything you want and we're gonna set it equal to a new scanner and then we're gonna put uh, round brackets and we're gonna type in system dot in because since the system has to take in something and we're gonna put semicolon so um, now let's ask the user what uh, what is your name. So to do this, we're just gonna do the, the standard system dot print out uh, print a line. We want to say uh, sorry. What is your name? Okay. So we're gonna put semicolon there, and we don't actually have the um, the scanner yet. Uh, since see, look, if we play this right now. It's not going to ask anything because we haven't um, told the user to put in something. And to do this, we're going to create a new string. Since the name is going to be a string, um, we're going to call it name. And we're just going to initialize it. We're not going to actually set it equal to anything because um, the user has to make the name equal to something. Their name, obviously. And we're going to activate the... Um, the scanner we're gonna set name equal to the input which is here um, dot next line with empty parameters so what this is saying is um, make the name which is a string uh, equal to the input which is the input here and then make it wait um, make it wait for something uh, make it wait uh, for the user input for the user to type their name in so that's uh, basically it to create user input and let's save it press play and ask what is your name and we could type in Patrick and that's user input so um, you can notice that nothing really happened after I typed in Patrick and right now we're gonna I know this is a little advanced but we're gonna uh, make it so uh, it says your name is Patrick. So um, we're gonna type in system dot out dot print ln, and we're gonna put in uh, quotations. Your name is space plus the name which you just typed in. And since Java looks from bottom uh, down, uh, sorry, top down. Uh, it will already have name since we put name equal to the input which is what he typed in so we saved it press play what is your name Patrick and it says your name is Patrick so this was a quick tutorial on user input let's just review um, we first imported the java.util.scanner which we need to create user input and we did all this class stuff you already guys you guys already know this um, and then we created a scanner and we just called it input and then new scanner and then system dot in which uh, the system needs something to put in to their system and then we create a string which is uh, the we create a string so we could have the uh, we could have it equal to the input and then we 
uh, just uh, said what is your name and then we said your name right here is equal to the input which is you which uh, you type you're gonna type in here and then we said dot next ln with empty parameters because we have to uh, wait for him for the user to type in their name and then we just printed it out your name is plus the name which is this so that's basically how to create user input in Java I hope you like this tutorial please uh, subscribe it really helps me out uh, comment below if you need questions or anything to say um, and please rate this video thumbs up if you liked it thumbs down if you didn't which I hope you did not and uh, this is slash films um, thanks for watching guys see you guys later bye